Libras. So, y'all, this is just gonna be like a random messages video for October. So, anything, any random messages that come out, that's what we're gonna be discussing. All right, so if you have Libra anywhere in your chart, it, it doesn't matter what placement it is. This reading is for you. Cross watchers are welcome as well. All right, so let's go ahead and get into it. See what your overall energy is. Libra. Libra. Libra, do you want to go off by yourself somewhere? I feel like some of you guys want to go off like alone and sneak off. <laughs> you could be in conflict with someone uh, coming up. And you just want to get away from whoever this individual is or you could be in conflict with yourself and you want to get away mm -hmm. something is going on maybe there's a betrayal that was found out or a ending that just like really just had you bent okay and you're over it yeah you want something new you may want a new foundation you may want a new home um you may be thinking about this actually and somebody could be providing something for you libra um or you're providing something for yourself maybe finding new resources because something just didn't pan out the way that you thought it would okay and you could be waiting for something to balance out before you take another leap into something else. All right. Some of y'all could have had like, um, some of y'all could be trying to find like a new car or something like that. Let me turn my light down. Some of y'all could be trying to find a new vehicle or trying to figure out what you're going to do with the vehicle that you have for some of you. There is some type of secret that is being held back, whether this is you holding the secret or someone else that you know, or that's in close proximity, something that you, you could be studying, you could be obsessed with this, you could be obsessed with um whatever it is that you're learning right now. Somebody could be obsessed with you and they're keeping that a secret like you don't know that this person is secretly admiring you or secretly obsessed with you um like i said i do see you waiting to invest your time effort or energy or money into something new you could be waiting for this to come in or you could be waiting for money to come in so that you can invest in something invest into something new so that you can get out of this stagnation that you may be in let me push this up a little bit Yeah, I feel like you are ready to break out of something that's just like you're tired of it. Could be something bad for you. It may not be anything bad for you. You just feel like you're tired of it. I know that. You could also be partnering up with an individual as well on something. You guys could be putting a lot of hard work into something that um, you feel like is emotionally fulfilling to you. Some of y'all are just ready to celebrate whatever this is. Yeah, somebody here is about to take off. Um, maybe with a creative endeavor. Somebody is getting recognition um, while being single. Some of you guys may be traveling, coming up or planning a trip i do see that somebody is coming towards you 
somebody could be coming towards you that um uh, they could be a little sad this person could be sad or this person made you sad before in the past they could be coming back in giving you what you want mm -hmm. there could have been like some separation or something between you and this individual this could have something to do with work as well somebody could be coming in wanting to take you on a trip um i think i mentioned a job offer like out of town I do feel like someone is like they're they like you because they view you as like abundant they view you as like the whole package is what i'm picking up that's what i'm feeling you just kind of want to be free though to do whatever you want to do somebody may find out another individual is married somebody may find out that um the person that told you that they were divorced they're not somebody could be losing their job someone significant other could be um financially draining them or being selfish maybe even breadcrumbing Some of y'all could be like nurses, travel nurses. Um, somebody here could be seeing a CNA working in healthcare. And you have, I mean, your your money is looking looking pretty okay. Um, some of y'all could work in childcare too. But it may not be paying you enough money. I am getting that. So you're trying to see what you could do that can make you more money. Or if you want to stay in that field, in that career field. Some of y'all could be receiving a message from an um, older feminine energy. Maybe in your family. Okay, so somebody here may be coming in, giving you something, or they may not give you everything that they could, but they could be giving you a little bit to see, like, how will you do and what you're going to do with the finances or the money that they give you or the resources that they give you. They're going to see how you're going to invest it. I see that. You're going to give them back a full return. Mm -hmm. This person could be a little concerned. They could be holding this in or they could be concerned that you're keeping secrets about what it is that they gave you. But you're going to come back with this return. You're going to give them something. Mm -hmm. You may end up helping this person or um, wh whatever it is that you received you may end up helping another individual that could be stuck in a rut. I'm seeing you showing somebody something. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It could be somebody in your family. It doesn't have to be. But somebody here may get a home with their with a friend, a partner, or a um somebody that you're dating. Mm -hmm. Y'all may decide to take it to the next level. A change happening in you guys' relationship that actually is for the better. Mm -hmm. Somebody here could have a child. One of you could have kids or both of you could have kids like not with each other. Something like that could be going on as well. Somebody could be giving you something as a gift this month as well, Libra. Somebody could be um, feeling a little worried about if they're going to have enough. Mm -hmm. If they're going to have enough mo enough money or enough um, uh, resources. I do see that coming to an end if you don't. I, if you're in a situation where you are struggling financially, I see you, that coming to an end. 
somebody that is like stuck somewhere else or maybe they can't make any movement they may not be near you this person is thinking about you passionately libra somebody could be expecting you somebody um also there could be someone that they planned on coming towards you but they can't make it so they're gonna send something else instead or this could be you Feel like everything is gonna work out. Y'all, some of y'all could be dealing with the Pisces, another Libra, Capricorn. Those are the uh, major arcana that's out, but it could be any sign. Yeah, some, someone is worried that something is going to be unsuccessful. They're, they're really worried about this. Mm -hmm. They're like, I don't know if I'm going to have enough finances or if I'm going to have everything I need because I'm kind of stuck. I can't move or I can't get out of the position that I'm in uh, easily. But I feel like it's going to work out. somebody that loves you is or that cares about your situation is going to help you or they're going to um yeah they're going to help you figure something out or this could be you doing this i told you this person is kind of worried because they're like am i going to stay stuck where i am or you're just frustrated where you are you're frustrated where you are you're wanting a change to take place and you could be getting angry some of y'all could feel like somebody is working behind your back and they could be somebody in your family could be working behind your back this could be somebody that you're tied to or somebody that you're close to somebody could be making an announcement that is going to kind of make you a little sad as well or it could um have you overwhelmed with emotions what i told you somebody here took what someone gave them and increased whatever it was that they gave them mm -hmm. and this could be in any way you this could have been quick or this could have been i went and invested this money into my future so i'm gonna have to build for it so some of y'all could have went and took a class went into school or something like that mm -hmm. did something that you're passionate about some of y'all could be getting a new job I'm telling you you're not gonna be if you if you are um lacking you're not gonna be lacking for long because something new is gonna come in there could be a um, masculine energy here that's in poverty and the reason being is because they're uh they operate out of greed okay when you operate out of greed that is a form of lack mentality okay you're not gonna keep anything operating out of greed because you feel like you need more all of the time <laughs> and the way that people go about getting things out of greed is in the negative energy it's in the negative energy it's a way that you um, gain abundance, okay? Major abundance. And I'll have to go into that into another, uh, in another segment or another video. But yeah, this person is greedy. This is why they stay in lack. This is why they don't get nowhere. This is why they stay stuck. Someone here. Mm -hmm. Danger, especially in money matters. This person always looking for money. Somebody is always looking for money. And it could be you, Libra, but I'm telling you, whatever way that somebody has been trying to do it or they've been operating out of, it's been in a devil energy. This is why it's never successful. They could feel like somebody has put like something on them. Somebody could feel like another individual like is stopping their money. <laughs> 
Okay. Yeah. So someone could come to you and you could be kind of concerned. You could be kind of concerned when they come towards you. Because this person has all types of problems. Like there are literally like a lot of issues that this person has going on. Some of the, um, for some of you, this person could come in very manipulative. Like I said, they could come in very manipulative, low vibrational. Watch for that. They could come in in a fiery energy. So they could be coming in very like charming, trying to, trying to be charming or attractive in a sexual way as well. I'm seeing that. Okay, but this that, that person, they're not going to be able to get in. It's going to be unsuccessful. It's not going to work. They're going to tie themselves in a knot trying to come towards you or get to you. Because whatever you're doing, you're loving that. Mm -hmm. You don't want to have anything to do with a low vibration, Libra. You already know. You're like, I'm not going to lower my standards for you or for this situation because I'm going to end up stuck. And I'm not trying to do that. All right, so um, yeah, this that's not gonna work. You already know you have many other options or many other things you could do because this person could come in trying to make it seem like they're they're gonna help you as well. Yeah, they could come in like, oh, um, you know, we can partner up, we could do this, this, that, and the third, and it's really not. You are the one that really may have like everything that you need. This person could be coming in very egotistical, so watch out for that as well stay in the energy of love though mm -hmm. stay in the energy of love just don't let this person come in and knock you off your track knock you off your square or however you want to put it so let's see what your um advice is see what your advice is whatever you choose though you're gonna make the right decision because this person is scoping they're watching you or they're trying to figure out will i be able to go towards libra to get what it is that i want some of y'all could be like a little confused mentally or you could be depressed wherever you are this is why you're wanting to get out of this yeah the magician and then the four of wands you are going to manifest yourself out of this uh situation the devil at the bottom of the deck because i'm telling y'all whatever you're bound to you're over it the four of cups in the reverse it, it, it definitely could be a job you're like, bro, I want to get away from this so bad. Like, what is my out? What is my out? When can I retreat? When can I pull back? I don't want to take a loss, though, and have to recover. You know, so what decision do I make? You go with the decision that best serves you. Mm -hmm, and that brings you peace, truth, clarity soul search y'all y'all soul searching mm -hmm. yeah y'all gonna get it though because y'all go from the nine of pentacles right to the ten of pentacles and whatever it is it's emotionally fulfilling like you really love whatever it is you are successful at this you're going to be successful at this it is a family member that that is um low vibrational could be a capricorn they're, they bring conflict. They bring conflict. This could be a mother figure. They bring conflict because of the simple fact that they're low vibrational. They never achieved. They never got out of the conflict that they were in. Okay? They're still in it. They're still in it. They probably see potential in you and they see you going somewhere and they kind of like they they don't like it. So low key hater. <laughs> All right. So your advice is to make a decision 
to free yourself from whatever this depression is give yourself recognition clap for yourself you know you're doing good manipulate the energy a little bit for for the better manipulate the energy like if this is surrounding a home or a workplace you could be in reunion with someone that could be good for you that's good for you could be a fire sign mm -hmm. but you can't see you can't see like your way out this is what it's seeming like but you are the key to getting yourself out of whatever the situation is libra all right so these were your messages if this video resonated with you please like share and subscribe thank you guys for watching and i'll talk to you next time